Do you have that as a stat check? Alright, into the matchup here. Look at all this Machamp power coming through today. It's Nebraska Poke and all yeah. over it. Zanelli versus Fumu. Fumu notoriously hating this matchup, and I can understand why. Zanelli not playing a whole lot, except for being at uh, Skyrim as it's plays practicing is from what I've heard. Yeah. So Zanelli has the ability to wreak a lot of havoc with his 8Y from a champ. Whoa, he does like that from, from downtown <laughs> submission. Fumu is like, man, only, from downtown again, once again being just punished. say that because he's like, it's like, down. That's all you're saying. <laughs> Alright, counter. So it's a nice low J Y right from Fumo, able to block in time and an effective punish on the wall. Yep, yep. Keeps his health. Yeah. Karate chops that. Ooh, goes to Eevee. A little too early on that draw there, so she'll have to keep that speed debuff. High jump kick, Fumo had nothing to lose, so might as well go for the kill. Yep, may as well. So if you lose the, if you lose the phase, uh, you still have burst. You have a ton of huge health lead. No harm in it. Good on Fumu. Just straight punishing the bulk up. Umbreon. Yeah, it gives it the no some space. Whoa! Covers the back dash. <laughs> oh my gosh. I like these moves. I'm liking this already. So Fumu is playing pretty aggressive in here. I think it's because he knows like he just has to keep it. He just has to keep offensive. He has to stay offensive on the champ. Yeah. He doesn't want all the champ being offensive. He's, one mess up in the in while playing defense against you. Yeah. Uh, going in for that Blaze King grab meta. Blaze King grab meta has the lowest dam one of the lowest damage you can have. It's low, low, but it's like it's such a good conditioning factor because if you do it in the first two games, you're like, yeah, you don't get great damage, but you always get the wall damage. So you get 30 plus 30, and then late game, you're like, alright, cool, is he gonna grab or is he gonna hit me for like 300 damage at the wall? So I really, I really hope Fumu incorporates that more into his gameplay because it's terrifying to be alone. Placing himself is terrifying. Yeah. Ooh, the Gengu? Oh, the Dark Shop. Interesting. What? Okay. I mean, I think he mentioned it at some point, maybe somewhere in the Discord. He, he delved far in Nebraska Discord, he probably did mention it at some point. But I didn't think he'd go Dark Shop. Yeah. The champ was not working, uh, so I agree with the counter pick. Uh, but guard chop is a counter pick. Not too sure. We'll see. Uh, Whoa! Going right in. High beats a cutter. <laughs> no, it works. Like I'm the grab. All right, all right, all right. All right, go. We're off to a good start. Off to a good start. You don't need guard chop tech to win with guard chop. Yeah. You just need home. You just need his essentials. His really good homing. Right. <laughs> he could have. He could have uh, six wide earlier. What is? Yeah. What is happening? Uh, he's throwing Fumo off guard. Yeah. Because he's so used to how Dale plays, sometimes newer players' characters can throw people off. Yeah. Never seen Fumo make the adjustment here. Just being a little more offensive now. He blasts, doesn't get caught by that. That's why, yeah, that is safe. Mulga okay, here, slow guard chomp, bad guard chomp. It's always the worst feeling in the world when, you're, when your opponent uses the Mulga as your first. Oh, Dig is good, Dig dude. is good. <laughs> dig is good, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> You saw it. Did you see that, Dale? You saw that, right? I saw that. Good. Dig went under top two. This does not go over. Peach Cutter does not go over it. Oh, Neo Justice. Give him the third one. Oh, he's not, he's not cool. Give him the third one. Who cares? Ugh. It's optimal for emotional damage. Optimality. Optimality isn't as fun. Nice half charge there on your CA. Three, three, three knees are height. Optimality can be. Alright. Fumu just content pestering here with these sidewise. Dig is good. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh. So good. Oh, I'm calling up the grab with the 2x. And grabbing. Let's see. Oh, going for the burst, I don't agree with this, because Dark Shop is a 250cc. So he most likely will not get it back in round three, but if he closes that here. Oh! Uh, Blaze King's gonna win. Yeah, Blaze King's gonna win. Blaze King uh, always wins. Yeah. I think the only one, the only one he doesn't win is a, is a shandy tie. Probably Age of Slash. No, he does be, he, he does, he can be Age of Slash, I guess. Because Age of Slash can just like do whatever it wants. His burst does last a while. Or no, Chandelure's, he, he's very specific. Oh, dig is good! Needy Dig is good. Needy Dig. Who would tell him to sit down? Sit down. Alright, alright. 
Chelsea. Chelsea? Doesn't really get too much on that. No. Doesn't he expected him to approach it? Eh? Dig is amazing, ladies and gentlemen. Oh. It was almost, Dig was almost amazing. Dig was almost cool. Almost. Oh, uh, no. Overheat. Yeah, Overheat. Overheat. Heat wave. Heat wave. Heat wave. I'm Heat Wave. <laughs> You're Heat Wave. Yeah, sure. I call it Overheat. Why are you calling Overheat? Oh. 